All right, thank you, Mary. Former Olympic swimmer Summer Sanders has Nebraska roots, and I've heard a few stories about her mom and my mom. They grew up together in Tecama, Nebraska, just right up the road. Right now, Summer's getting ready for the Warrior Dash, and she joins us this morning to explain how. Good to have you back on the blend, Summer. How are you? Oh my gosh, it's so good to see you. And I tell everybody who will listen that I have Nebraska roots. I think my mom, she may have taught me mom first as my first word, and then it was quickly go Huskers. <laughs> exactly. So, I mean, we bleed red That's in my awesome. mom's house. No, it's good to have you back on the blend. Last year, you were here a couple years ago promoting, I think it was the, uh, the swim trials. I wasn't here in the studio, but it's, it's good to have you back on the show. Uh, what is the Warrior Dash? Explain what that is. I, I know a lot of people, I've got friends that have done the Warrior Dash. Explain it. Yeah, it's basically, um, it's a muddy, awesome obstacle course. So if you're looking for something new, you want some excitement in your exercise routine or just something to inspire you um, to try something new in your workout, that's what it is, but it's muddy. And I've partnered with Delta to get people to embrace the mess in their life as a life well lived. <laughs> and if you think about it, when you get messy, you think that you're five again. Right. Everyone wants to be more youthful and this is the perfect way to do it. Yeah, if you're gonna do this warrior dash, you're gonna get down and dirty. How can our viewers get involved? Yeah. Um, well, you can go to warriordash.com. There are a lot of races still left to be run. In fact, I'm running, I ran one last weekend mm -hmm. um, in the Indianapolis, just outside of Indianapolis, and that'll be my third. Um, yeah, so there's lots of different, they're all over the country. So if you can't find one right in your neck of the woods, think about where you're going to be traveling and, and plan it with your friends. What I see in a lot of these races are costumes, uh, friends coming together, uh, co-workers, so it's a team building. It's not a race for time. I don't see uh, a lot of scoreboards for time. It's all about accomplishing the obstacle together, being a team, challenging yourself, and then crossing the muddy finish line. And then the best part of all, taking an awesome shower and getting it all off of you. Right, exactly, cleaning up a little bit. What is it? I've heard this term, happy mess. Yeah. Happy mess. What is that? Yes. Yeah. So that's, what, that's the term we've coined, and I think it just sort of sums it up completely. When you think about getting messy, I mean, I think now as a mom of a seven and a nine-year-old, I'm constantly saying to them, don't drink your drink out there on the sofa, drink it in the kitchen, you don't wanna make a mess. So it's always about like, don't make a mess. Well, this is the one time in life when you want to be messy. Making a mess means a life well lived, and that's our message, and that's why we put together the hashtag happy mess. So you can follow us at Delta Fawcett on both Twitter and Instagram. Um, my Twitter is at Summer Sanders underscore, and you can see all of the happy mess that we're creating across the country. Yeah, and one of the things I want to ta ask you about is the, you, you mentioned the shower experience. What, yeah. What's the shower experience like? Well, so the first Warrior Dash I did was a couple years ago, and we had hoses and we squirted ourselves off. And then I went to a Warrior Dash in May in Baltimore, and we had this innovative showering system by Delta Faucets. And these uh, shower heads are actually water sense labeled. That means they're using much less water than normal faucet heads. In fact, a family in the US, if they installed a water sense shower head, it would be saving them about 3,000 gallons of water a year. That's a ton. Mm -hmm. um, and a lot, of, a lot of states are worried about their water right now, so that's important to me. Yeah. But the showering situation was so much different that people had to like push me out of the shower. I mean, people were showing up <laughs> with their little cartons, their little plastic containers with their soap in it uh -huh. to get a full shower done. Right. Um, so yeah, we were kind of spoiled and it's great. But it's, you know, it's just like camping. You go camp and you get messy. And then the best feeling of all is when you walk through that door and you get to take your first shower right. and get it all off. Exactly. That's, that's the full experience. Refreshing, that's right. I've got, like I said, I've got a lot of friends that have done the Warrior Dash. How about a website to go to if people um, are, are traveling, they want to hit one of these Warrior Dashes across the country? Yeah, at warriordash.com. Look it up, sign, it, sign up for it. Don't be scared. Get on out there and challenge yourself. That's right. Summer, thanks for your time. Great, great catching up with you. And tell your mom, your mom Barb, hello it's for It's good to catch up mom. with you. I will, I will, and go Huskers. Okay, that's right, go Huskers. All right, Mary, over to you.